Yeah, so Lachlan Murphy had, uh, had a pretty heavy collision in the third quarter on the weekend. Experienced some neck pain and given his history, um, you know, we're all a little bit concerned about it. He was unable to finish the game. Uh, we uh, put him through an MRI yesterday as a precaution and he was cleared of any serious damage there. So we expect him to, to, to train tomorrow and be available on the weekend. He's walking around now, he's, he's doing everything in the gym and, and uh, we expect no real issues with him. So Riley Philthorpe uh, came out of COVID protocols last Wednesday. Um, he had some symptoms early um, with his COVID, so we were a bit um, uh, cautious with him. He completed a full session on both Wednesday and Friday uh, last week, and uh, he'll be in normal training this week and be available for selection for the weekend. So Zach Taylor's worked really hard on his conditioning with Jared Wallace and Josh Manuel and Tim Parham and, and given that it was a thumb uh, fracture he was able to complete a whole lot of conditioning which is pleasing. Uh, he's got through that, uh, he's available for, selec for selection this weekend um, and uh, yeah he's really looking forward to getting back playing. Yes, yeah, sloney has been in most days and annoying everybody, wanting wanting every manner of treatment and and, uh, and and attention on his knee but he's been fantastic, the brace is off and and he's just working through the, the, the unfortunately frustratingly slow process of, of rehab, but he's doing everything that, that we're asking him all.